Miss Tamika and Thank Sandy you. from Sesame Sense. And yes. today we are coming to give y'all some tips and tricks before we do the super doubles in the morning. Yes. So okay. many people have been asking questions when we do videos because they've never heard of Harris Teeter, etc. We thought it was time. Yeah, or you might you just need to tell you what we do. That juice. way you can know what we do. Okay, so yes. I just want to let y'all know that down below is the updated, not that, oh, I'm going to put it down below, but in the other video from yesterday is the updated Harris Teeter Super Doubles list. That was posted this morning, guys. Yes. So, we have some updated deals. Yes. So, here we go. We're going to start with what we start with. Let's just start with the policy. It's pretty easy. We can just run through it really quickly. Okay. Um, But you need to know this. All right. Okay. So, one coupon per item scan. Y'all know that. No cash back for the coupon overage. But, yes. I don't know if they still do this back in the day. They would give you a gift card. But, yes. I don't know if they still so, do that. So, yeah. If you do get overage, if you're doing all freebies, sometimes you can get overage if you're doing a promotion. And you, your overage would be kind of yeah. like that. But they don't. I don't think they do that no more. They used to give gift cards, but I think you just had to get stuff. Yeah. Okay. Twenty coupons will double um, on super doubles. It will be two dollars and under. Yeah. You can use any coupon during this period, but we suggest that you use your high, your big boys. Big boys. There's a lot of good deals this week, so you might want to plan a day that you're not using all your coupons. That is a because tip. there's a lot of just good deals. Yes. So a lot of times, especially if we have time, we do like to go the day before or the mm -hmm. day that week and clear out everything you have that's your 99 cents and under. So just utilizing the regular Harris Teeter double policy, which is 99 cent under, under every other. day. <laughs> so we do like to do that, so that way you haven't missed out on any deals. You didn't got mm -hmm. everything. And there's a lot get. of deals this week that don't have coupons. Yeah. So that we talked about yesterday, the the Pepsi two. Leaders. I ain't yep. got a coupon. It's a great deal. Yep. Um, and like you that. know, and a pet, what is it? A, the Pillsbury Toasted Strudels Toasted is a great Strudels. deal. So yeah. those are things that you might want to plan a day. It might be light or later in the week when things are gone. You can add yeah. that into your total. Yes. Okay. They will accept three light coupons. Um, that will double. The fourth coupon will be at face value. That's a tricky thing. Okay. Yeah. Because just like we talked about with the uh, uh, Turkey Hill ice cream, you can use five coupons. Even though the policy says that, you use five coupons, three will double. Sometimes all five will double. Yes. But if you're having a cashier with an attitude, you might have somebody take two. She had an experience where they doubled this hers down. This has happened to me um, But with times. me, I've never had them double them down. If yeah. it just works, it works. But you never know, guys. You just, it depends on the cashier. Okay. They will take three internet printables. So, coupons.com, Red Plum. Any of those printables that we suggest you print, they will take three okay. likes of those. Yes. Um, they also accept kept competitive coupons. And this usually means Food Line Publix or... That's it. That's it. For a grocery store within the vicinity of, of the your grocery area. Store. Yes. Mm -hmm. Like, just leave it at that period. No, they won't take uh, Walgreens no, anymore, any of that stuff. So, yeah. just know that. It just depends. But Even that's if all it's a Catalina, they're not taking it. Yeah. They may take it at your store, but we're telling you what the truth is because we call. They ain't taking it. Okay. Next. <laughs> um. Oh, one thing they do not take free coupons printed online. Mm -hmm. So, like for instance, when the Dixie Crystal did the free coupon the other day, if you guys got that, if it's printed from your house, they will not take it. Mm -hmm. Has to be mailed with a seal. That's all they will take. Yeah. Um. Which one did you just point to me? No at? expired coupons. No, yeah. That. They no one. No they expired. don't take none expired. Um. They will not let you stack your evics anymore. So it's either evic. Or paper. Even coupons do not double. They we've do had not double. That, we've had that question, so yep. they do not double. They don't. Okay. Um, and then if you forget a coupon during checkout, now they will not allow you to go over to customer service and get your money back. You will simply have to return the item, folks. If you don't want to keep it, yep. return it. There and you that's go. It. That's the way around that. Okay. Yep. Now, do all coupons double? No. They don't. Even if it, a lot of, a lot of y'all know some of these coupons say do not double on them. They might double. Yeah. I had, actually, the lady took, what, okay, this is not true. The lady took my last Super Double. She took my coupons that, that, that yours doubled, mine didn't, and she wouldn't let me get the items. Yes, so, although mine had doubled. And so, yeah, so. it just kind of depends, but their policy does state, if it says do not double and it does not double, they're yeah. not doubling it. Yep. That's the easiest way to figure yep, that out. But if go. it goes ahead and doubles and they don't realize it. Then let it go. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, but it, sometimes they will cut you off and not let you get stuff. Yes. We're just telling y'all the truth. Yes. This is what happens. Do you want to talk okay. about rain checks? Yeah, is, worth, is rain checks really worth it anymore? No. Um, not unless it's an EVIC special. Yes. It doesn't require a coupon. You can no longer use coupons and rain checks together. Yeah. So, and as far as I know, they do not do promotions on rain checks. So, this promo, that Colgate promotion that we had... If you get a rain check for it, you're just going to pay regular price or yeah. a dollar, but you can't yeah. use coupon with it. So, no, yeah. they're not worth so it unless it's a free EVIC special. Yeah. Unless it's a, a really discounted item uh, EVIC special. That's the only time that you get uh, yes. rain checks. It's like the dollar seventy seven milk we had this weekend. If you needed that That's a good and thing. it was out, then yeah. go ahead and get your rain for check. For any regular but, deals that they're mm -hmm. out of. But not for You uh, can only coupons. get rain checks for items that they are out of that are on sale. That's true. Has mm -hmm. to be on sale. 
cannot be they just out of it and you it's salty okay that's good i didn't even know yes that. it mm -hmm. all, like i've learned this over time if they have it in stock like a variation let's say it's coke zero but you want coke zero cherry well mm. if you want the coke zero cherry and it's out you can get it for the item if it's on sale but not if it's just out. Not if it's just out. Okay. okay. All right. So now we are on the tips. This is what we do. So I'm going to start off with something that I yeah. do personally. <laughs> One thing I do is I go through and I check my Catalina coupons. This is a Catalina hair seeder. These may double. They may not. Back in the day, they always doubled. No problems. If they say, this one does not say. Okay. This one says down at the bottom, do not double. So it's possible it won't double. It's the same rule. So check all your Catalinas because yeah. this allows you to get more deals that may, other people might not know. Like this is a dollar yes. off a of Klondike bar. When we get any kind of money off Klondike bar. Never. So you might want to keep these, check them, and sometimes they double, sometimes they won't. But I always go through and check my Catalina. Yeah, this is the truth. Next is, I'm going to tell you, let me just say this real quick. One thing that we both do is we search for coupons that are off more than one item. So yes. this is a dollar off of two gear deli. So you want to use these kind of coupons first because you're gonna get more items for that 20, 20 coupon limit. Yeah. So this is a dollar off of two. So I will get two items and I'm only using one, one coupon, coupon out of those 20 coupon limit that we have. Yes. That's a good another way to utilize your coupons, guys. It is, so like, and I, Tamika taught me this and it's one of the best things she ever taught me was like multi using it to get more. So you'll have coupons that are similar like that here daily. Like if it's a 50 cent off of one, yeah. You try or to use whatever you, you got. You want to use what's, what's going to give you the best value, but if you don't mind paying 25 cent or 50 cent extra to get more stuff, or you might not have stuff. to pay extra. It yep. just depends. But you want to try to use those coupons that give you more products. Yeah. And you know, you're still in that. You only use one coupon um, in that 20 coupon limit. Yes. That's one of our favorite things to do. So, mm -hmm. like we mentioned before, you want to always have deals backed up. This mm -hmm. is the same thing that we're mentioning. You need to have other deals. Mm -hmm. Other coupons that you don't know if are on sale that you can check. Because if you're like sleepy like me and you don't like to get up at 445 <laughs> um, then a lot of stuff may be gone but it's mm -hmm. okay we don't fret folks we can't fret because we got deals backed up that's okay. it we have I have my 20 coupons this is my items that I'm looking for then I might have 10 additional coupons of items that I may want and we'll see if there's available. Now, we know this is a good super doubles. I also realized that we have the Purcell packs at our store. Hey. Um, the, the small packs. So, I was excited. So, We're I'm going to try to get them there. tomorrow, y'all. But, um, just to let you know, that's what you want to do. You want to have a back 20 sets. And you want to have maybe 10 or whatever you want to have as a backup as set a backup. to replace as fillers. Yes. You got that 20. You might as well use all 20. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So, this is similar to, because we kind of jotted a few things down. You always want to have your items that you want to go to. The things that are most important to you. Is it mm -hmm. paper towels, toilet paper, detergent? go there first mm -hmm. and then everything else you can get it if there's promotions that are going on you want to get the promotions go straight there mm -hmm. know the map of your store where That's are it. you going mm -hmm. how do you get there mm -hmm. like things like that we know our store like the back of our hand until they moved it and they moved it. But that's yeah, okay. We, we, but we still, still know mm -hmm. where things are for the mm -hmm. most part. So that's one thing that's super, super important. Um, also, just making sure that you know your rules when it comes to your coupon policy. That's really important. Know you have a twenty, twenty dollar. I mean, amount limit. Oh, also one thing. Oh, with the twenty limit. Mm -hmm. What you about to say? Yeah, I'm probably what you about to say. Go ahead. Um, you can use items that are higher value than your two dollars. So, for instance, if you have a three dollar off of one and the thing is three forty nine and you want to get it. That does not count against your 20, 20 coupon limit mm -hmm. because that item is not going to, that coupon's not doubling. Mm -hmm. So you, if you have a bunch of those coupons, you can use as many of it. Well, three, you, you can use three. Three like? Three of those, mm -hmm. only three. But that's a way to maximize your coupons, mm -hmm. folks. Yeah. Also something I just thought about. Mm -hmm. Probably what I was about to say. Go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> something else I just thought about was the fact that when you have Catalinas that have printed from, let's say, a food line or a Harris Teeter, that if it doubles, if it's $2 or a dollar and it doubles, that counts in your 20 items. Mm -hmm. So keep that in mind. Mm -hmm. These, that's what yes, we're about. but if mm -hmm. it's also, if it's just generic, if it's a buy five and you get $5 back in a Catalina, that $5 would not count for your 20. Mm -hmm. But if it's $2, it's gonna double to four, that will count against your 20. Yep. So keep that in mind, folks. Okay, also, the thing that you need to realize is, yes, there's a 20 coupon limit that will double, but you can use 40 coupons. You can you use 40. 40, but doesn't matter. 20 is only going to double. only 20 are doubling. Mm -hmm. So keep that in the cranium. Okay, so okay. the next thing that I personally do, this is what I do. This Cindy does not do this. I do this. So while we're in, while we're in line waiting on um, them to check our products out, well, or waiting on the line because it depends on how busy it is. Usually during a week, a Wednesday super doubles, it's not that many people there. Nope. 
Um, but on a Sunday, Super Doubles is packed. Packed Okay, rim. so this is what I do. So while I'm sitting there, I have my envelope. So I have an envelope that says Super Doubles on it. I'm writing down how many $2 coupons I got, how many $1 coupons I got, how many whatever coupons I got. This way, when my when my final total is done, if there's a issue, I can go back and say, well, this $2 coupon didn't double or this $1 coupon didn't double. Ooh, I just got it's tip. a good, good thing to do. That way you are backtracking because sometimes you might not remember which ones you use. Because deals may change while you're in the store. You might have had your 20 set, but you might only use 15. So make sure, get, this is the tip. Write it down while you're standing there. It's That's what I do. Know. And it helps yeah. me figure out if anything went wrong. I, bet. I don't do that, but I do know how much my total should be. Mm -hmm. That I know. Because what I do is I look at my car and I'm like, that's a dollar, that's two dollars, that's free, and I count it up like that, so that way I know I should be at twelve dollars plus tax. So if it's fourteen, I'm not fretting. But if it's thirty, we got a problem. That's it. Okay, mm -hmm. one thing I just thought about that I just forgot that quick. It mm. was good. What was it? Shoot. Oh, hold on. Hold wait. on. <laughs> I don't know. We was right. talking about counting coupons. That's yeah. all I oh, know. Oh, make sure you're watching when your coupons double on the screen. Do not like hand them the coupons. Like just, this. Look at this. Look. Listen, if you, we go to that U scan <laughs> because it says out loud what it doubles to. Mm -hmm. Mentally, because that's how we figured out stuff didn't double up the last time, like with that Evian water. Mm -hmm. That's how we knew because it mm -hmm. said double a dollar fifty. No. And we no, knew. That's not nope. right. Nope. Like, <laughs> Or a dollar ten. It was supposed to be a dollar fifty. It will tell you how much it doubled or if it did not double. Make sure you listen, folks. I like personally. I like going to U Scan that way. It's in my face and I can see. We can I rather see go to I Scan. You I Scan. You Scan versus going in the line because sometimes stuff gets jumbled up. This is just my own they be personal scanning tip. Too quick. Yeah. They at the U Scan into the override. They did beep 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 to the mm -hmm. regular line. We ain't got time. But in U Scan, it's right there in your face. You can see everything. Can. Okay, guys. I think that might be it. Yes. Oh, don't forget when you're looking for promotions like this Colgate promotion that's been going on, make sure you're looking. That is separate and apart, and it'll say like, it'll Colgate say like Colgate promo, promo yeah. in a certain amount, and that's after you push the pay button, folks. So that's one thing we also do, and this is the last tip. When we do our coupons, we scan everything first. We do not scan our card first. Mm -hmm. Scan everything first, mm -hmm. and then scan your card. See all your discounts. Those are going to be your mm -hmm. EVIC, whatever, and then push the pay button. After you push pay, that's when your EVIC, EVIC personalized specials come off. Mm -hmm. Things like that. Your Colgate promo will come off. Things like that. Your EV mm -hmm. coupons will come off. That is really important. That's it's a, a way really to have tip. control over what's taking place. So just oh, kind of yeah. keep that in mind. And that's a good mind. tip because also you just have all your coupons lined up. So you just scan your eyeballs all the yep. way down. And then you know. There you go. And there you know. All right, all right guys. Now, if y'all have yeah. any questions about Super Doubles, please yes. put them down below. It starts in the morning at 7 a.m. We did not say this. People, yes. Most people know. 7 a.m. 24 hour stores, 7 a.m. 7 a.m. They will not matter. double 7 until 7 a.m. It yep. will end on August the 8th, which I messed up yesterday. So forgive us. August. August the sixth. I gave you. Two, I took four days yesterday, and then I added two things. It's okay. August so seven thirty one through eight six, guys, is when this will be happening. It starts yes. in the morning at seven a.m. Any questions? Leave them down below. If you like these videos, if you want us to make more informational yes. videos like this, let please let know. us know. Make sure you hit that bell notification down below. Y'all have a great day. Bye. Happy Super Doubling! Yay.